7 a.m. here at the flea market. I'm here with my beautiful wife, Danny. Asher and Zeke spent the night at Grammy's. Shout out Mama Flipper. So we were at the flea market together this morning for the first time almost ever. So she's gonna hopefully help me find some good stuff and be my good luck charm. Let's go. It's pretty early, people are still setting up, but I already see people with Ikea bags. This is it, we talked about oh, this one. The dino, yeah, the big, yeah. Three. <laughs> you want the, the sign? Want the bike and the sign. The bike and the sign? Mm -hmm. She wants ten and three. Did you take ten for the bike and the sign? Sure. Okay. Can you make change for 20? Yes. What? Oh. Well, we'll, we'll take this sign too. How much for this one? It goes with it, right? Kind of. Three. Yeah. Three? Three. three? Alright, yeah. we'll, take, we'll take that one too. Morning. How much do you want for this? I do fifteen. Fifteen. $39.99. I mean, there's money to be made, but. Is that a Buck's jersey? Yeah, it's a, it's a kid's size, though. Yeah, they're not really worth it. It's not the same box. CZ9926. 19 listed. 10 sold. Good comp, so. Danny. Bundy. Bundy. What's up, man? There he is. There's the guy. Listen, if you want to see the the truck, I'm just kidding. How much are the shoes? Thirty-five. Here you go, Matt's, Matt's got a couple things, those Simpsons vans are cool. And then I got some stuff in the park. Would you take 25 on them? 30? Alright, I'll do that. You got change? Oh, look, look, I was looking at myself and I was trying to look at you. Alright man, see ya. Good morning. Good, how are you? Air Armor Boots. Air Max, Matt Easy is sleeping. These are right next to him. How much are your shoes? Which one? Um, so, I'd be interested in these, uh, these, and then these right here. And maybe possibly the boots as well, depending on the price. Alright. She says $7. Okay. 
This guy's usually pretty expensive wherever he is, but Air Max 97s. Let's see how much he wants for those. Two pairs of Air Max 90. Air Max Plus. Kind of slim today. He usually has a lot more. Some Danner boots. Small size. Botany 500. Oh wow. Dooney and Burke Nightmare Before Christmas bag. That's pretty cool. Looks authentic. Stitching looks good. Hey, good for the winter time. Yeah. Hold that. What's up, brother? Good. How much is the bag? 30. 30? Put the camera on here. Buy it. <laughs> you wouldn't have seen that if I would have said look up. Eight results. Yeah. I definitely wouldn't have. Seven sold. Wow. <laughs> That's crazy. What did he say? 35? Mm -hmm. Thank you. Appreciate it. I'll be back on the 15th. Yeah, yeah. Okay, Alright, brother. I see think you. I have your number, right? No? Uh, I think I've given it to you before, but I'll give it to you again real quick. 407. Alright, well, Danny already found the best item of the day, probably. It's crazy. This Dooney and Burke Nightmare Before Christmas bag should get like 150 to 200. These are good Under Armour. Sir, how much are these? Those are 40. 40? Yeah, those are the Bluetooth ones, you know. They're Bluetooth? Yeah. Yeah, it keeps track of your, see the Bluetooth? They're the, oh, wow. they're the, they're over 200 bucks, but. They run small though. Yeah, they also run small. Yeah. My son, thought he, you know, he was going to use them, but he couldn't use them because they, they ran so small. How much you got on these? Those are 15. 15, and then these ones right here? Those are 20. 20? What do you have in the bag? Starbucks mug. Starbucks mug. Can't take you anywhere. Guru shoes. No, not original insoles. They want 20, but they're kind of worn. I'm gonna ask if they'll take 10. Would you take 10 on these? Would you take 10 on these? Sure. Okay. <laughs> Sacred Beanie Babies. Yeah, the little ones are a dollar. The big ones are a little more. Okay, no problem. The big ones are like some of these are like three, two for five. Okay, thanks. But they're, they're pretty collectible. That, that one, you. that one. I know some of them. Are the real expensive ones I pulled out. Oh yeah, I would do. Hello, Bean. That's nice. Express is expensive, but I don't know. Well, it's a mall brand. Doesn't resell well. But this, even though it's new, it could be worth some money. Yeah. 
These are these are good too. These Nike fly nets. These sock me Shadow 5000s. They're wet, but I think it's just because of the rain or whatever. But some of these are worth a lot. I mean, look what she paid for them. Seven ninety nine. So I'm going to explain this clip real quick and I have it on 2x just because it was pretty long but this guy here on the left the one in the orange t-shirt this is his booth and this table had a bunch of like fox racing motocross pants and there was a jacket a vintage NASCAR like interstate battery jacket and every time I asked him price he said I don't know I got to look it up. And then when he looks it up and he looks on eBay comps of listeds and not even solds, then he just started asking ridiculous prices. He wanted like 40 bucks for the jacket and uh, he wanted like 25 bucks for the pants, which to me was a little crazy. And I asked him if he would negotiate and he was telling me to look up the prices and make him a fair offer. And that's just not what you're at the flea market to do. If you want to sell on eBay, then sell on eBay. All right, so we just left the flea market. It was getting really hot. We're both hungry, and there wasn't as much stuff that's usually there for me to find. I was really trying to dig a little bit, and um, being a little bit picky on condition, though, because they've raised their prices, a lot of the vendors. And so we did get some good stuff, though. Found some really good stuff for $10, like the Tony Llama boots for $10, the Kobe high tops for $10. Uh, Danny found that Dooney and Burke purse, which was the find of the day for uh should get somewhere between like 150 to 200 for it uh, and pay 25 for that that guy where we got that table from uh he usually has hokas and brooks and good shoes and he didn't have anything so he said he wouldn't have anything until the 15th so it looks like the vendors are even struggling a little bit but uh overall still a good trip i got two guitar hero guitars that are wireless i paid 15 dollars for both and i'll uh, lot those up together and probably get like 120 for them uh, so that was good too, but uh, all right. Yeah, we're gonna head to breakfast and um, Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. What do you have to say to the people? Peace, money. <laughs> wow <laughs>